for our next community conversation and we are joined by Megan Wood, Director of Professional Development at Albemarle County Public Schools. Thank you so much for being here today. Thanks for having me. Yes, we are happy to have you. And tell us a little bit about what what is making connections for people who don't know about it? Sure, so each year we offer a, an annual conference for faculty and staff. Um, last year we hosted all of our division employees, which was new, we added our classified and support staff. So it's in, actually it's in two locations. One is at Albemarle High School, um, and that is for our support staff. And then the other offerings are at Monticello High School, and that's for all of our instructional staff. But it is, when you think of a professional conference, that's exactly what making connections is, is for our staff. Perfect, so tell us a little bit about what some of the standout programs are that are going to be offered this year. There's some new stuff, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have a lot of great um, external presenters are coming. Um, Dr. Rick Romelli is going to come and he's going to talk about grading practices to support some of the grading changes we've made in the last couple of years at the high school level. Um, we have several professors from UVA coming to talk about the science of reading. We have um, some professors from JMU also coming to talk about how to support instruction and um, and reading in the secondary level as well. Awesome, so so many good things for people to learn. Why do you hope that every educator is gonna walk away? No, I know you're hoping that they're all gonna take away something big right. from this. What are some of the things that you're hoping are the key takeaways? Yeah, I think we hope that one of three things happens, right? One, that they find something that sparks curiosity that then they jump into learning um, more about with instructional coaches in the division or with their professional learning communities. So that would be one hope is, is that they walk away and something that they've learned in that day is something that they want to really dive deeper into. Yeah. Um, the other thing is is that a lot of the sessions are designed so that um, things can change their practice immediately so that you would hope you know that they walked away with something that they could use the very next day yeah. um, and improve their practice right to support our students. And then the other thing that we hope that people get from the experiences is that they find colleagues um, that are interested in things that are similar to them so that they can start to work together and to collaborate um, to support practices. Yeah, and that's something that could make a big, big difference too. Right. Um, how does making connections benefit students here in our community? Right, so anytime that teachers or staff, support staff, um, better their practice and their skills, it benefits our students, right? And so there's a lot of different topics for all uh, of our staff members, and that's how we hope that it benefits, right? That it translates, it's either if it's a teacher that it translates to what happens in the classroom, or if it's a bus driver, it translates to students' experiences on the bus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and finally, um, how can members the community learn more about this work learn more about what's happening yeah, we've built a website um, because there's a ton of sessions that we're offering I think somebody asked me today and I think we're up to like 350 wow. um, so there's a website that we have and, and the link to the making connections website is on our for staff page um, and if you click on that it'll take you straight to our making connections website and you can see all the different things that we're offering all right love it anything else you want to add real quick before we go no I don't think so all right good stuff happening thank you so much for taking the time yep. to be here thank you yep we'll have you back soon All right. and we will be right back.